criminal. What the fuck you think it is, blood? Fuck with drugs and the steel up. Well, I grew up in the fuck some hood. My niggas used to steal drugs. Some of them used to boost cars, but the fiends had them appliances. Around here, nigga, so you could die for your alliances. It's common sense, nigga, so you ain't gotta be no scientist. Be careful in that jungle, though, cause that's where them big old lions is. And yeah, they gon' devour niggas. As soon as you start to move wrong, better wake your ass up, nigga. This ain't the time to get your shoes on. Wear some butts scraper, nigga, and I always got my shoes on. See, money been the topic, nigga, I don't know what the fuck you fools on. I'm just trying to get attention, niggas trying to get a bitch. Ball player figures, I'm just running for a pinch. I loot these fuck dudes with moves like James Winston. My motherfucking dogs, why the laws had to pinch me? Yeah, I'm still smoking loud with thick clouds around my head, though. Head up and chest, I thank you, God, that I ain't dead, bro. These people ain't solid, you ain't even gotta say it, though. Dedicated to the topic, and I'm still running behind this bread, bro. Oh, the world of the story is, still sitting in the fucking pen. Tony went the same, you hit potato on the same case. Blue ball down, no ball parole. Uncle Bray, they open doors. Sending out some letters. All this is Rasko Fettuccini so right here. The topic. That's so fatty. I don't know why I should be saying. Listen, I don't make it last. Then no shit, I take the case. Never will I pick a face. Seen the stars, I change the race. Make it for my people's sake. We just need a right away. Run right down on them niggas' head. Let them know it ain't no plan. Be with them, I'm growing fat. Loyalty, I'm under that. At first, ain't no running back. Front line, I'm on top of that. See some way who copping what. Who's what got them telling now? He ain't have to speak. Wrote it down, so what's the statement about? Hold my own one, take me out. Be the truth, and that's on scout. Catch your it's Rascal Fetty. Go look him up on Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. He has a website. He's on TikTok, Spotify. He's everywhere. Rascal Fetty. That right there was the topic. I like that. Like, I am one of those. I'm one of those uh, listeners. Um, first and foremost, welcome to Spotlight Radio Show. Um, everybody will be on um, at, let's see, five more minutes. But I just want to get on right now to. Um, Play a jam or two from Roscoe Fetty. This is another song called Crazy. We go way back. He'll be jumping on shortly. It's just me against the world. Got me feeling like I'm too pop. Fucking riding in these streets. Just last week I bought a new block. Heard a nigga got his boot shot when they ran off in this new spot. Gotta watch out for them jack boys. They always in a shootout. Watch how you maneuver that snatchy person's off a of school. If I think they on some fuck shit, then I'm dumping out the Uber. Man, motherfuck them people from my nigga tired school. Heard a life size rat that went and told it on my shooter. These days you never know who in your circle could be a hoe. They might fuck with you today, but tomorrow it be different though. Different strokes for different folks, hope you don't take me for no joke. Bet I'll playin' with your man before I write rice me a hoe. Niggas got some likes of women when they see a nigga win. Never really been your friend all along, they just pretending. Hope the innocent get out the way when them goons start spinning. Self six tools a wound a nigga and make the wound start spinning. See, this shit be kind of crazy. Wrestling demons on the daily. Don't know why they say they love me when they show me that they hate me. Like they don't understand, yeah, I've been going through some things. Smoking loud to quiet the pain and try to ease a nigga brain. Think I'm going to say it yeah. anymore, but I can lose it. Strapped up with a tool, they hope a nigga don't make me use it. See, they don't understand, yeah, I've been going through some things. Smoking loud to quiet the pain and try to ease a nigga brain. See, I've been smoking on that loud, it got me feeling good. Real certified street nigga, I'm always in the hood. Hope you don't get it twisted or misunderstood. Cause even though I'm educated, shit, I wish a nigga would. Beating black and blue, yeah, that ass don't get bruised. Those scary ass nigga ran off and left the shoe. 
Shoot the shot a minute back and put his ass on the loop. But I'm a bigger man than that. Plus that shit ain't even cool. I'd rather give a nigga knowledge shit and try to drop some jewels on it. Get it how you live, but abide by the rules, homie. See all that funny shit, I make a nigga act a fool, homie. Hope you watch your back and keep your motherfucking tools on this shit been kinda crazy, rest of demons on the daily. Don't know why they say they love me when they show me that they hate me. Like they don't understand, yeah, I've been going through some things. Smoking loud to quiet the pain and try to ease a nigga brain. Think I'm going to say at any moment I could lose it. Strapped up with a tool, they hope a nigga don't make me use it. See, they don't understand, yeah, I've been going through some things. Smoking loud to quiet the pain and try to ease a nigga brain. Yeah. What's up, everybody? I am Tessa Allen, host of Spotlight Radio Show on Global Radio Station Street 93.3. It's the favorite night of the week. It is Wednesday night, and I really appreciate the love and support. Um, it's January the 31st, so tomorrow is February. Um, next week, next Wednesday night, February the 7th, will be um, the last show for my 10 years, then the very next day, I'll be celebrating 11 years hosting Spotlight Radio Show, Spotlight Radio Show's 11-year anniversary at Legacy Barbers of the Woodlands. So if you have in nothing to do between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m., please come out. Um, come get your hair cut. Come get your nose hair cut out of there or waxed out of there come get a facial um there's plenty of barbers there it's a real nice spot um in the woodlands and also i'll be giving giving away some things and i will be live streaming from spotlightradioshow.com um shout out to uh, my manager angela the manager shout out to kami kami's corner is up and running on spotlightradioshow.com um also there's a special promotion um, for my 11 years, for $11, you can get an $11 interview, virtual, podcast, whatever, however you want it. Um, I'm doing a 11, 11 month, $11 promotion on Spotlight Radio Show. I mean, SpotlightRadioShow.com on the website. So if you have a video that you want to post, you can post a video for 11 months. From February to December 31st for only $11. And the thing is, each month you can send me a different video. Okay? Videos, if you're posting a video. Um, if you're posting, um, if you want to post a flyer, you can remove that video and post a flyer. Once a month you can send over one item for the next 11 months. Only for $11 for SpotlightRadioShow.com. All you got to do is hit my manager, Angela, the manager. She'll give you all the details and sign you up and get you hooked up and everything and get everything rolling. But I just want to just give a big shout out to all my supporters. Big shout out to Fire Media Mogul. Um, if it wasn't for her creating um, her platform, AT Media Broadcasting Company, I would not be here right here in front of your face right now. Do you hear me? But I want to give a big shout out to her. I'm um, coming March 8th, 9th, and 10th at the Camp Street Blues Fest in Crockett, Texas. Uh, Spotlight Radio Show will be down on that Saturday, uh, March the 9th. I will be covering the Camp Street Blues Fest um, down in Crockett, Texas. So you can go to SpotlightRadioShow.com to get more information about that. And also Camp Street Blues. Hey, Miss Gita. You can also go to Camp Street Blues um, and check that out. Like I said, um, the first two songs that I just played was Roscoe Fetty. So you can go to his YouTube channel and check that out. And also SpotlightRadioShow.com to follow him on. We're going to bring him on. Let's see here. Five, four, three. Hey, Miss Kita. Thanks for tuning in. All right, here we go. Roscoe Fetty, baby. Fetty was good. Welcome to Spotlight Radio Show. How are you doing? I'm good. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Good. You? Yes, I can hear you. I, I want to get those words off. Darn it. How are you doing? I've been good, yourself. I've been good. Thanks for coming to Spotlight Radio Show. It's always a pleasure. You already yes, know. absolutely. So we were just I was just jamming um the topic and crazy. I was just saying, like, your music, uh, you can't 
pick a favorite. I can pick some favorites, right. but you really can't pick a favorite. That's one thing about um, your production and your style of music. Even and then I was sitting here like, um, I can't tell. Do I like the hook or do I like your bird? Right. You be stabbing. You be stabbing in the side and the throat. Like it's hard. Like you be. Woo. So. Yeah. I, I, I do want to say this. Um, I do like when you do have a feature, you know what I'm saying? Because you go so, uh, the whole song, yes, you know, so. Yeah, what's been going on? Man, I've just been grinding. I've just been grinding. That's it. A lot of shows, um, a lot of promo, advertising, marketing, just mm -hmm. be busy, 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 you know. Um, yeah. I dropped a song for Stunner for Vegas like a couple of months ago. Um, it's been going crazy. Um, I just dropped crazy. It's been going crazy. Yeah. Um, and then I got uh, mood music with um currency mm -hmm. getting ready to drop. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I seen that. I seen. I was like, I, every flyer, every post I've been seeing you performing. I'm so. I was just saying that um before radio, like you would come out to my shows, you and your family, and then radio, like so. It's you've been doing this. What well, I mean, it's way over eleven years, and mm -hmm. like now it seems like I'm like, dang, he. I mean, you everywhere. Like you've got all these shows lined up. Um, you also on. I seen that you were featured on another station. I think it was three sixty five. Yeah. I forgot the show. Um, that you're um, featured on, your song is featured on. So I was like, wow, kudos to you. But you've been like nonstop. It's been. Have you taken a break though? No, I mean, no. I, I did, I did take a break. Um, uh, you know, after my son, you know, yeah, um, got, yeah, you know, after my son, you know, um, I lost my son to gun violence about two years ago. You know, so mm -hmm. I just been trying to deal with that, and so I did take a break. You know, what I'm saying I was trying to get my mental back mm -hmm. together, you know what I'm saying, and try to stay strong. But, I mean, losing a child is something I would never wish on no parent, you know, like, that's, mm -hmm. that's yeah. the whole problem, yeah. you know, so. Now, I, I said my blisses. Yeah. On my, um, driving here tonight, I was thinking about him, and I was thinking about you, and I was thinking, I was like, should I start the show out with that? And I was like, no, I'm just going to wait until you say something. But, oh, my goodness, my heart ached for you so much. You know, I don't have any kids, but I felt your pain. I still feel it, you know. Yeah, because that was my baby, you know, that was my baby. Like, man, I just, I mean, you know, all my kids, like, they, they all my babies. Mm -hmm. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, like my, my boys, like, that was the one that was closest to me. Like, that was the one always up under me, you know, yes. so. It, it's just, Absolutely. It's Absolutely. Just, yeah. But you keep strong. You keep strong. You keep strong and keep going for him, for sure, especially for your other kids. I see your daughter is getting, she's getting big. She's growing up. Yeah, she's 15 now. P.E. P.E. on me, Yeah. Oh, my gosh. My baby didn't stay a baby forever, okay. but she, she, we can't keep them babies forever, I guess. That's right. Is she, is she into music? Um. Well, yes, yeah, she likes music. Um, she's starting to get get into it a little bit. Um, but I, I want her to focus on school first, get her grades, and you know, make sure everything with school is right before I I, I just put her in the music industry. Mm -hmm. You know, like it's a lot. It's a lot, and then it's a, a never ending grind. Like mm -hmm. you always grinding. Like ain't no days off. Like ain't no such thing. When you take a day off, you get that much further behind you. So yeah. Yeah, it's a constant grind. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Wait, one other thing before we get keep going. Please tell Scooter. Tell him I said hello. How is he doing? Have you talked to him? Yeah, he um he good. I talked to him the other day. He good. He in good spirits. Everything good. He ought to be home this year. So okay. Please tell him I said hello. And I most definitely will. I most definitely will. yes, absolutely. So I know you got a performance coming up in March. Um. Can you give us more details about it? Cause I love that flyer. Okay, huh? so um, you you talking about the French event? Yes, yes. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. So um, so I hooked up with this 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 uh promoter in Houston, great DJ friend. You know what I'm saying? Like um DJ Craig, okay. you feel me? Like cool people, he good people. You feel me? Like um, so they be doing this thing um like exotic Sunday. So I ended up hooking up with him and um like man they they 
they they got a platform over there. They really building and grinding and growing. You know what I'm saying? It's like a dispensary, but they showcase artists and whatnot. You get to come in, smoke, shop, all that good stuff. Enjoy some good music. There's a lot of good people coming through. A lot of he got a lot of network, and he know a lot of people. So you never know who's gonna be in the building. Right, right, yeah, absolutely. I was like, yes, Roscoe, steady, steady in it, steady in the in the performance and getting out there. I really, really love that. Do you have any merch out? That's like probably the only thing I haven't seen. I'm working on merch right now. We're working on that right now because, like, I mean, that's 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 the one part I ain't even gonna lie. Like, I can't lie to you. I've been slacking because I got designs. Right. Don't get me wrong. I have I have plenty of designs because you know I like to draw and doodle and whatnot. Yes. So plenty of designs it's just uh, it's just been so much going on like traveling mm -hmm. and doing shows here mm -hmm. doing shows here then i'm up for award um i'm nominated for award um at the yo atl vmas again yo atl raps i'm up for underground artist of the year um yeah. I'm right, do they still have the voting open for that yes ma'am yes ma'am okay okay yeah i've went online for that yes so i have to post that link on my website as yes, well so people can go and vote. Go, 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 go. <laughs> yes, congratulations on that. I was like, hell yeah. Man, yeah, yeah. One thing yeah. I, I do want, one thing I want from you um, as merch, I would love a little um, pocket purse, you know, with the little zipper on it. Mm -hmm. And so, whatever you put on the front of it, but I want a little Fetty mini coin purse. Yeah, okay, I got you, I got you, I got you. Because, um, I'm actually gonna start with um t-shirts, but at the same time, mm -hmm. um, I already like I said, I already have designs and whatnot. I already know where I'm going with it. Um, mm -hmm. I have female clothing already, like everything is mm -hmm. already in the making, already in the process. So we're working on that. We're trying to get that sometime, get that started sometime here before this first quarter is over. Okay. Absolutely. <laughs> my fan fell. Hold on, my fan. I gotta have a fan. Yeah. Man. Got to have a plan. So I see that you're in your studio. Your studio still holding it down. Has anything changed in there? Have you done anything different in your studio? Um, um <coughs> no, we we actually want to make some upgrades now though. Okay. So it's pretty much still the same. Um <coughs> I've upgraded my microphone. Okay. Um, um I upgraded my my uh my interface um mm -hmm. you can give me a Mac, uh, macbook now um so i'm working on that i'm, I'm just trying to but but we're going to expand though we're going to we're going to take this I, I think i'm just going to take this one and, and get a whole new one because the one i want is is, is better mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying because i cut hair and do all kind of stuff so okay. i'm gonna I'm set a barber shop up in the front then the whole section is going to be like the lounge area everybody chilling playing the video game okay. watching movies then the back Bad, absolutely. I can't wait to come out. Please let me know the grand opening. Most I will be there. Most definitely, cause I, I'm, I'm actually, I'm actually working on some stuff. I'm trying to put together something um to where I do like uh maybe you know fans or whatnot come out. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm trying to find a venue now. Do like um Fetty Fridays with mm -hmm. Fetty. You know what I'm saying? And mm -hmm. then it just be you know what I'm saying everybody come through and just vibe. You know, I rock out some of my music. You know what I'm saying? I might have a couple of guest artists. Yeah. Have yeah. some special people in the building. You never know. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, it's just a grind. Like, and I, I love networking. You know that already. Mm -hmm. So I love yeah. new people. You never Absolutely. Know. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, that's what I said earlier uh, before you jumped on. Like one thing about you, you, um, before I knew what you know networking and promoting was, you and your family was on it. Y'all go network from the time you people. get out the car. From the time you get in the place and from the time you're out. Can't nobody do it like you. Hands <laughs> and passing our flies at the same time. Yeah. Like, it's, it's yes. Down. That's Absolutely. Just me. Yes, so, me. I know you were in the era of CDs, so now it's more stream. So, what is the difference for you? Like, is it better? Or do um, you, you know? More people, more people get to hear you strings. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm gonna say it like that. More people hear you, your your music gets a broader audience as far as streaming okay. versus with CDs. You used to have to go hand to hand and sell them or, or, or go to the store and try to wholesale them to them or whatnot. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So it's it's better as far as listening. Um, 
streaming I, streaming really don't pay much you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying like streaming really don't mm -hmm. streaming don't pay like people some people would think mm -hmm. it does you know what i'm saying but if you're in the music mm -hmm. you know streaming pays pennies on the dollar right like i heard i seen an interview where snoop dogg said he had a billion streams and he only made forty five thousand dollars wow wow so just wow about it like streaming really don't pay nothing like um because if you think about it like okay so the song with uh that i have was stunner for vegas it said like i think i want to say last time i checked the numbers it was like thirty two thousand streams okay and then and um, I think crazy was at like twenty seven thousand. Yes, might have made five, I might have made five dollars. I might have five dollars in my wallet from that. Wow, wow, that's crazy. Yeah, that, that's crazy for real. Yeah, I love crazy. I love um with crazy with that song crazy. I love the beats. I love. I always love your flow. But I love how once you start okay this is how 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 you sound to me like i can hear every single word that you say right, right i don't know i don't know how you do that like i can't listen to other artists and it's like that i don't know what you do or what it is in your voice <laughs> perfect it practice makes perfect i always got told like um so i like i said i've met a lot of people and, and, and a lot of these people you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. that i meet i i noticed that real big um hearing what you say that they're really mm -hmm. enunciating and people being able to understand what you're saying when people can understand yeah. what you're saying clearly they tend to relate to it more you feel what i'm saying versus yeah, yeah. somebody rapping and then just blah blah blah, blah and then mm -hmm. come back with a word i understand like uh what did he just say mm -hmm. but when you can mm -hmm. yeah yeah you know, and once you just listen and get into it like the stories that i be telling like it's real life mm -hmm. you feel what i'm saying like mm -hmm. it's, it's just I've always been, you know what I'm saying, more of a realist, so my stuff is more life-related, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, absolutely. It seemed like you was reading from a text message. <laughs> yeah, it was real. I love your visual. Um, I love the um, um, how you had the silver and fifth, and, and I, that part stood out to me right. because just by, 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 just by me riding the Conroe, right, right, right. and people – People don't even be out like they used to anymore. Do people still go to Tiana's? No. <laughs> what happened? I don't, like, you know, I, don't know. I really don't know. Um, I really don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, this it's crazy how rich this area is with talented, talented yeah. individuals and people that that really have creative minds. You feel what yeah. I'm saying? But I feel like a lot of times, like we really don't have no platform, no outlet. You know what I'm saying? To get yeah, that outlet, yeah. so we have to go other places to try to get mm -hmm. that out there and so i just feel i don't know maybe people just started migrating to other areas because like conroe ain't what it used to be yeah, you know, I, know. Like to be. I know yeah that used to, like we finna go to the road yeah. yes yeah. Like, yeah. every weekend every weekend friday saturday and sunday people was in conroe man I remember yes when yes when on Friday night, everybody be at Jersey's on Saturday night, yeah. everybody yeah. parking whatnot on Sundays, mm -hmm. like, man, what is going on? Right, like, I was like, you know, I'm just 46, but even, like, my, my oldest niece and nephews, you know, they 25 and stuff, but they don't even want to hang out at the club like we used to at 25, 26, 27. Yeah. Like, then, that was the place to be, you know, like, like when yeah. we were growing up, that was the place to be, like, and I mean, now, now it's more so, I mean, I still have to be in the club, you know, mm -hmm. I got to grind network, you feel me? Like, mm -hmm. but like, it, it just used to be the place to be. Like everybody knew, everybody that you wanted to see was going to be there. Everybody that yeah. you knew was going to be there. Like that's where the party was. Yes. Yeah. I think it's more house parties, house parties and business parties now. Right. You know, right. Right. Absolutely. I mean, and then only because I mean, everybody trying to grind and get to the money. You like, mm -hmm. like I mean, so it only makes sense to, to 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 throw something that's gonna benefit people. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Tell me this: What did you do um, when the when the ice storm came? Were you stuck at home, or did you go out and work? I was I was cool. I, I was cool. I was cool in the house. You know, I was cool in the house because, like mm -hmm. I said, it's plenty for me to do inside. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. Inside, if, if, if I ain't listening to a beat or, or mm -hmm. writing a song, I'm working on a video, I'm editing a video, working on a fly, mm -hmm. working on a post. I'm doing something. Absolutely. 
is there anything that you need help with? Because I know you produce. I know you make your own beats. Is there anything that you'd be like, hey, I got to get someone to do this? Or you do everything? I do everything. I do everything. everything. Still doing everything. I do everything. Pretty much, um, I, like, I do everything myself. Um, I'm, I, I've been lately here. I've been trying to get a team together, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Somebody to help with the marketing and advertising side of it because mm -hmm. I'm starting to get busy than what I, I normally have been, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, yeah. it's starting to pick up now, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, it, it's really starting to grow. Like, I, I, I've i seen a lot of progress, you know, like, and like, I'm mm -hmm. on TikTok, I drop a video, you know what I'm saying, on TikTok, man. Yeah, your like TikTok is banging. Yeah, <laughs> it is, it is, it is. And that's, a, that's a big platform, and I, I still ain't utilizing it to the, to the, to the full advantage, okay. like, I'm taking full advantage of it. You know what I'm saying? Because, like I say, it's it's a lot when mm -hmm. you doing everything yourself. And everything, yes. I got to post on. I got I got to post on. I feel like I got to post on Instagram four five times a day. I feel like I got to mm -hmm. post on TikTok four times a day. I feel like I got to post on Facebook. I got to post on um, Twitter. I got to post everything. Like I'm yeah. very well. Yes, like, I know. Believe me, I feel your pain on that because just being me by myself, thank God I got a manager now just to book my interviews. But um, posting, like sometimes that'll put me, that'll make me so feel so overwhelmed to where I, I'll shut down. Yeah. To where I'll be like, okay, let me just post one post. Yeah, I, I feel that. It does. It definitely does. It's, like I say, cause it's just a process. Like it's just a mm -hmm. constant grind. Mm -hmm. it's just yeah. A constant grind. You don't understand that then i don't know what to tell you but you're gonna be busy if you especially doing music like you're gonna be super busy doing music yes absolutely so is there anything that you have coming up that you have not put out on facebook TikTok, or instagram or twitter yet that you can disclose with us mm, i've been talking to oh. zay told me okay all right and i've been he, he and i've been conversating for mm -hmm. a while now um we we're trying to work out something. I ain't gonna give y'all too much, but okay. we, we we working. We working, working. something. Yeah, I always know you. All, well, you always you gonna always have that one, that one enchilada rolled up over there on that plate. <laughs> yeah, always. Yes. I, and Zay told me the real dude. He real. He real. I ain't even gonna lie to you. He real because I'm sure it's a million people hit him up. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get access. Mm -hmm. to him, man, and it was just something about. About me, I guess they caught his attention. You know what I'm saying, and and yeah. he's been cool. Like he he um he reached out to me, you know, checked on me with my with my daughter's situation or whatnot. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Checked on yes, kids and whatnot. Like he he he's a, he's a real individual. Absolutely. Real. I'm glad you're yeah. making that connection. I'm so glad you're making that connection. Oh, yeah. So you know, Spotlight Radio Show. I gotta put you on the spot. Do you have a beat that you can drop exclusive? right now i want to hear okay so y'all want to hear a beat yeah Some, something that ain't the world ain't heard yet absolutely i live i'm in love with your beats yeah, I, I got something i definitely got something i always got something cooking okay that's something in the pot um and has it been named yet um yeah these beats have a name but um they like not that not like that's not the name if if like if you choose to buy the beat then you can name it whatever okay. you want to name it like it's just whatever came to my head while i was making it that's what mm -hmm. they okay. so, um so I'll, I'll play one of them for you real okay. quick yeah give us a little snippet oh yeah i got you i got you because these are basically snippets <laughs> okay so this is right. gonna be titled more than a dream okay can you hear it? I can hear it. Yeah, that's real deep. That's real deep. Yeah, that's real yeah. deep. It's 
gonna be a story, but for whoever decides to, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. I love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, I yeah, that's, yeah, I love that. That's either you solo talking about maybe some love life. That could be a love life. And also, I could see you in a car yeah. rolling. Get some shit off your yeah. chest. The yeah. realest. Yeah, I I have a I have a song um called Backseat Conversation. It's okay. it's it, it's me in a car, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like I already have the video done. Really? The videos already. I just ain't dropped this shit. I'm, 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 okay. I'm, 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 I'm yeah. Building. Your visuals are killing it. I think it's the, the, the topic, where it's like you're in the dark and it's like a light flashing over you. Is that? Yeah. In that video, man, that's my favorite part. It's like, um, we coming. Yeah, we coming. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know we haven't been out, but that's still my shit. But I love yeah. that. I don't know why, but that part with that light, like right above your head, mm -hmm. that's my favorite part in that video. You know, I be looking at everything. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that was deep. That was deep. That was deep because I actually told him, you know, like, um, well, actually, it was his idea. Okay. He was like, we need to do something like, something different like i i need to i need to capture you like in a way i ain't captured you before you like and i was like what are you talking about man? he was like just look at the light at the light and as i looked up at the light like i was actually thinking about something uh-huh so that's, that's kind of where that came okay from. Like, I, I, I was actually like, like as he was talking to me i was like thinking about something and uh -huh. he captured that yeah well i love but i it was real like i yeah. love that part about that video <laughs> yeah, yes absolutely <laughs> I know exactly what you're talking about. Where I kind of looked up at the light, cause like I said, yeah. I was thinking as mm -hmm. he was talking to me. Yeah, that's my. Favorite. And the topic is, is actually like um, the topic, man. That, that it, it's it's a, it's a deep song if you just listen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, the thing about my music is you have to listen. I don't yeah. want you just listen like everybody else's music. I want you to actually mm -hmm. listen, cause if you actually listen, there's a message in the music. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what message you're going to get out of it. a message in the music, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Because, mm -hmm. I, I, like I said, I, I base, my music is based on real life, stuff I've actually been through, stuff. That's why the stories are so detailed. That's why I can tell them so good, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. like, stuff I've actually been through and experienced. Yes. I mean, they say experience is the best teacher. That's right. Absolutely right. Yes, yeah. I hate to let you go, but is there anything that you want to say um, uh, to your fans, people that listen, people that will come back and listen to this podcast? Um, yeah, just just check me out, man. Stay tuned in, tap in. You know what I'm saying? Um, follow me on IG if you're not following me. Um, just tap in on some social. Yes. Everything, I, TikTok, all that. Um, at Roscoe Fetty, FGO. Um, I'm on the same person on all social, so it's easy to find me. Absolutely. Um, like I say, uh, check, check out. Make sure y'all go tap in. Check out Crazy. It's on Apple Music, Spotify, and mm -hmm. all that good stuff. Whatever you, whatever you stream music on, go check out. Um, give them yeah. this stuff, Vegas. Check out, man. Just tap in, and, and I promise you, some big stuff in the works. Absolutely. Yes. Well, congratulations on your nominee for, especially for the awards. I can't wait to um, see what happens. I mean, you are always winning. So even if just to, just to be nominated, yeah, is is a is a win and, for me and, for you. And, and the crazy thing about that nomination is because when he told me I was mm -hmm. nominated, like I was, I was, I was, I was proud. Like yeah. I'd be grind. Like, um, but he was like, um, I was like, so. I'm only nominated in one category. He was like, yeah. I like, oh, no, nah, I ain't grinding enough. I ain't grinding enough. He's like, no, nah, man, okay. you good. Oh, I'm not good okay. to you. I'm good to me. good enough. I need to be nominated in multiple categories. Then yeah. I know I'm grinding. Right. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's still a proud moment. Like, I'm steady achieving new things. So, mm -hmm. and winning an award, being nominated, just be nominated, like, that's a blessing for yes, real. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, especially from ATL. Absolutely. Well, I'm super excited for you. I can't wait to see uh, what comes up for 2024 for you. Yeah. I cannot wait till when you drop your merch. Just please, I, got I drop I got those you. little women corn purses with a little zipper on it. Even if you got a hand draw mine, 
I'll I get it. I got you. I got right. you. I promise. No, I got you. you. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much. I appreciate the love and thank you for coming to Spotlight Radio Show. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. And I always, I always love you. Feel me? I already, I, yes. I always. You've been so real. Thank, thank you, Fatty. All right, we'll talk soon. I appreciate the love. Talk to you soon. All right. Yeah, have a good one. All right. All right, you too. Thanks, guys. All right, shout out to everybody that tuned in to Spotlight Radio with Roscoe Fetty. Don't forget, you can go to SpotlightRadioShow.com. You can go to his pages. You can go to his TikTok. He's, like, everywhere. You can go to his YouTube channel. Uh, please go vote for him for the ATL Awards. Um, you can go to his Instagram page, like, right now. Even if you go to his Instagram page and tag him and tag Spotlight Radio Show, I'll enter you for a gift for my 11 year anniversary. I really appreciate the love guys. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Roscoe Fetty. Yes, ma'am. Holla back. All right. All right.